I do most of the disciplining in the house. Colton's might have got spanked four or five times in his whole entire life living in that house. Discipline hasn't worked for at least the last year. It actually just gets worse. Lena doesn't really have a backbone. Lena gives in because she doesn't want to deal with all the stress and we have other kids that need our attention and sometimes it's easier to look the other way, but it's gotten out of control. What is your ownership in how he is? I mean, my ownership is that I've been too much of a pushover. But when we're calling and asking people for help, that's pretty much what they're saying. Like, you just have to let him break the law so that way he can well, go to jail and learn the hard way. That or hurt but somebody. It that's... seems like you're trying to get other people to raise your son. No. Well, unfortunately, it was so, there was so much tension, tension in the house. And, like, uh, we, he, he would come but in. But he's your child. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. But I have to protect uh, because, my other two boys you know, as well. Who's, uh, and I'm not saying that you don't, and that may, be, that may come down to the choice you have to make. Right. Uh, I'm very pragmatic, but you know, who's really raising Cole? Now, according to you, in 2015, in August, he goes to private school, and he's kind of taken under the principal's wing. She kind of took him under her, it, her wing. Him. 2017, September, great-grandmother, police called, October, Kicked out of private school, police called. December, returns to parents for a week and a half. Uh -huh. Ran away to a friend's house, police called. Christmas Day, police called. Mental health facility, March been acted. 2018, January, military school, AWOL, kicked out, police called. February, mental health facility, Baker acted. February, grandmother, uh, March, couch yeah. surfing. I mean, it's, it's all, it, it, I, who's raising this kid? Well, he's he's running trying the to raise himself. He, he, he acts he like he doesn't all. need anybody to raise him. He right. thinks he's raised. Well, the teacher's statement regarding Cole, according to school reports, the most immature kid I have ever had in any class in 25 years. He is so rude and disrespectful. Yesterday, he was not here. I had no problem in my class. Today, it was terrible. He makes it difficult for me to do my job. Cole is the single most disruptive student I have ever experienced. I am truly tired of Cole and his behavior. The commandant at the military school said this child is incorrigible and unteachable. But he won't take, like when, when we would get those notes home and we would say, Colton, what happened at school today? Oh, it wasn't my fault. The teacher's stupid. The teacher lied. He will never take responsibility. Okay. No, no okay. responsibility. So, it's always somebody else's fault. Okay, but what is your ownership? You've got, you've got different educational institutions saying you have delivered to me the most disruptive, incorrigible, and teachable student I have ever encountered, mom and dad. Yeah. yeah, I know. That's what they're saying to you, and I'm wanting to know what you have done to create that. You well, can't say it's all him. Well, I mean, the thing about it is, is last year, if you would have met him, he will yes, sir, and yes, ma'am, you to death. All it's right. just when he wants... Okay, what does that tell you? We've been doing something wrong. What, what, I mean, I, what it should tell you is that that is within his repertoire of behavior. He has the ability to be appropriate. I, I oh, believe yes. that. He turns okay. it on and off like a light switch. And he's smart. It's okay, not, then how can you look at him and say you're psychotic? Because I guess it's just frustrating. Because when psychotics we're, cannot do that. Because the we're zero. Not doctors. Well, we don't know what the I, difference between a psychotic. Well, then don't or, use doctor terms. I apologize, but the zero not remorse. Not to me, to him. The zero remorse. The abusing of his mother and his, his other brother, uh, the verbal abuse, uh, zero, has no care. Yeah. I mean... Most kids the, would come to you after they're not mad anymore and say, Mom, I'm sorry, I called you dumb and stupid. That's not something no, he has ever he ever laughs done. about it and thinks it's funny. Uses it against and to me, me yes, that seems a little... Something. Maybe wrong term, not... not yes, I feel I like there's something wrong, 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 wrong with term. Do you know what psychotic like means? In balance or something. Apparently not what I said. Yeah. And so, no, I'm not going to sit okay. here and... I'm not going to give you a test. I'm not going to well, grade it. But I don't think you really know what that means. I think you mean something else. I know I think he's you not mean, happy. I think really what you mean is antisocial personality disorder. <laughs> I think what you mean is you have no remorse. You don't have any guilt. You exploit people. You're very selfish. You're narcissistic. You don't care about anybody but yourself. You make up your own rules. You comply with nothing. Yes, sir. I, I, is that a little more accurate? Yes, sir. Yeah.